what Laurent captured is this, this understanding of the way John is capable of communicating and reaching audiences and collaborating with filmmakers. And he's a very complex figure. You know, he's, he's a number of things. Uh, he's, he's, a, he's, he's very humble, and yet, you know, he's brilliant. He's a, he's a genius. Uh, he's very, very kind, and yet he's, 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 he's driven as an artist. And he's, he's a taskmaster. And uh, Laurent, thank you for your film. You, you really captured all that, and you're going to see that uh, in, a, in a moment. Um, and to the maestro himself, I just have to thank him for allowing us, uh, for trusting us, to have this honor of telling this story. And now to somebody who knows him far better than I do, Stephen. Uh -huh. Thank you, Ronnie. Thank you. Um, first of all, I, I want to thank Bob Ghazali and the a AFI board and everyone for doing something they've never done before, which is to open the AFI Festival with a documentary. That is a wonderful thing to, a wonderful precedent to, to really be able to, you know, uh, place the documentary form exactly where it belongs, right up alongside the narrative form. So thank you very much for that. Often, you might even leave a film that John Williams has scored, and a week later you may forget the film, but you will never forget the music. Yeah, a few of my films, people say, I really love the score. What was that from? <laughs> but I just want to be able to say that and to, to lead into the screening that uh, I love loved John. He is much more of a dear family friend, a family member. He's the greatest creative partner I have ever had in the 52 years John and I have been working together, him scoring my films in this industry. This is the greatest partner I have ever had in the creative arts. So please sit back or lean forward and enjoy the life of John Williams. Thank you.